Members of the Craft and Dry Goods Vendors Association are participating in a training seminar on COVID-19 protocols. We get the details in this report by Rajvaro Lawrence. The Ministry of Tourism, Investment, Creative Industries, Culture and Information, in collaboration with the Department of Environmental Health, is facilitating a three-day COVID-19 protocol training for vendors of the arcade and craft market. Tourism Officer Samantha Charles explained that upon completion, vendors will receive a certificate of COVID compliance from the Ministry of Tourism. This enables vendors the ability to leverage their status as safe operators as well as increased marketability as they will be listed on the ministry's website where their status will be featured as well. The intention of the training is to really bring to the attention of the vendors the health and safety guidelines that has been set aside for the operations and those guidelines came about by virtue of um, a number of site visits to, the, to both establishments in the ministry and Ministry of Health to determine um, example where um, proper exiting is required, social distancing, etc. So following those site visits, a COVID action plan was developed for the vendors arcade and that will be replicated for the craft market and the, the um, protocols were developed out of that um, COVID action plan. So we're hoping that at the end of the week, we have as many vendors as possible trained to have subsequent sessions next week to cover the rest of the vendors and that they understand what the safe operations entail, what they should do and should not do, and how they engage their clients, visitors, and locals when they come to the craft market and the vendors. Approximately 90 vendors will be trained at the three day workshop. President of the St. Lucia Craft and Dry Goods Vendors Association, Peter Isaac, highlighted that the training will allow vendors to be able to once again benefit from the tourism sector, especially with the cruise season having recently commenced. This exercise here now is to make sure that the vendors understand the protocol, understand how to behave and the approach and the regulations and the rules so that they could behave as as accordingly to how we're supposed to. Um, so we are, uh, we are pleased that this is happening in collaboration with the Council's Business Council, the Ministry of Health and the Ministry of Tourism, the Defenders Association, and we are happy because we want the facilities that we have vendors there who are making out a living from the tourism industry to, to be a part of it, so to speak. And therefore, if they come to the workshop and, and they, they are considered to be people who are trained and they are COVID certified, then the facility with a few of it can be COVID certified. And that's the, the important thing for us because we think that we have been making a, a significant contribution to the development of, of tourism basically and that we would like to, to participate, we would like to be involved, especially with the crew sector. The training is scheduled for the 2nd to the 4th of November 2021. From the Government Information Service, Rajvaro Lawrence reporting.